So the problem we have is we need to encode and decode either files or text easily. So the solution, we decided to create a PowerShell script to use both uh, the 2Base64 string I.O. file and input text to either encode or decode. So in this section, we're actually seeing basically if it's text or file. If it's file, we'll pull in a file. If it's text, we just bring in the contents of the text. And then if it is a file, we'll actually bring in a graphic user interface. So let's run it. So we ran, it's a text. This is a test. And highlight it. That's the encoded content of this is a test. Let's copy it. Run it again. Let's do decode text number two. Paste what we just put in. And it says this is a test. So now let's do files. We'll do one to file, do the GUI, grab the file we want to do, which is idafree.exe, and it just created idafree.exe.b64. Let's do it again. Let's pick the file that we just created, the b64, hit OK. That's what I want to create. Let's do test.exe. Enter, and then yes, we'll test it, and it worked. So, if you want to reproduce this yourself, here's the code. <laughs> 